Are you looking for solid wood frames that will beautifully showcase your matted artwork, photographs, and collectible prints? Look no further than Archival Methods Gallery 12 wood frames, available in black, white, and maple. Everything you need to frame your matted piece is right in the box, including hardware, UV filtering glazing, acid-free backing board, even picture wire and wall hooks. All you need is a Phillips head screwdriver. To show you exactly how easy it is to frame your matted piece yourself, the first thing to do is remove the two screws that attach the stringer to the back of the frame. When reassembled, this solid wood stringer holds your matted piece securely in place with six strong screws. With the stringer placed aside for a moment, it is easy to remove the UV filtering glazing and acid-free backing board. The UV filtering glazing has a protective sheet on both the front and the back. To remove these sheets, start from a corner and simply pull it away from the glazing. A convenient way to address this process is to take a standard mailing tube and use it to roll back the protective sheet. This technique is especially useful for larger sheets of glazing. When you get towards the end, gently hold the glazing down by the edges to prevent it from moving. The protective sheet removed from one side of the glazing, place it by the edges on top of your matted piece and carefully repeat the process. Next, place the acid-free backing board behind your matted work to form a three-piece unit. With your frame placed face down on your clean work surface, place the glazing, the matted piece, and the backing board into the frame. Then replace the stringer with the two original screws. Occasionally, a bit of extra pressure on the stringer or the screwdriver is necessary to make sure these screws find their corresponding holes. When finished with this step, flip your framed piece over and check for dust or fingerprints on the inside of the frame before securing the stringer with the remaining four screws. While still face down on your clean work surface, attach the picture hanging hardware at your desired location with the two short screws included with the kit. Next, thread the picture wire through the hardware loops twice, as shown, and trim to size before wrapping the ends around the wire itself. Lastly, locate the two picture hanging hooks that came with the frame and use both when hanging your piece. When it comes to elegance and archival quality, at an economical price, nothing comes close to Archival Methods Gallery 12 frames. They're the right choice for all your framing needs.